Oh, special delivery. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. You're with Nicole, and if you're new here, I share lots of delicious homestyle recipes as well as baking tips and tricks. So today I have a very special delivery from the folks at Fruzy. I have here the Optimum Thermocook Pro 2.0. Super excited to get this set up in my kitchen. I can't wait to share this with you. So let's get to it. So essentially this is going to be my new kitchen helper. I'm really excited with it because I chose this one in particular because it does literally so many different things. It can make jam, it can make dough, you can steam things, like it's just unbelievable. It's a 21 in one kitchen appliance. So there's hundreds of built-in recipes as well, which is super exciting and I just think with the amount of time that I spend in the kitchen, it's just gonna make my hot life a whole lot easier. It's also the rival for um, the Thermomix. So, and everyone knows about the Thermomix. So I'm really excited to try it. Today, we're gonna get it set up here in its new home. We're gonna welcome it to the kitchen and make a recipe, just a quick one. All right, let's unbox this baby. to unbox it this way but it's kind of fun oh look it look it can you guys still see me this looks awesome oh found it in Australia too which I absolutely love but this is way more slimline than what I was expecting and oh check it out is that a touch screen okay I'm getting distracted by all of the all the things that it does here. Hold on, I'll just show you real quick. Check it out. Chopping, whipping, mixing, emulsifying, milling, kneading, cooking, blending. Wait, what does that say? So staring, I can't read today. Steaming, weighing, precise heating. This is my kind of appliance. Another reason why I got this appliance is because I'm currently pregnant with twins and I'm hungry all the time. So this has, as I said, hundreds of built-in recipes, which is awesome. And it's just gonna help me in the kitchen. And as well, when they're born, I'm gonna be making them food all the time because I hear little ones are just hungry all the time. Um, so it's just gonna be really easy because um, I can make them purees and um, slices and that kind of thing. Looks like this is the spatula or scraper. We've got here a butterfly whisk. This here, I think, will be the steamer. Yeah, that looks like a steamer. Probably not gonna use that this morning, so I'll pop that to the side, but that would be awesome. And actually now, I'm just thinking about dumplings. What have we got here? Okay, this looks like the big bowl. Oh yeah, that's what you want. And this here, I believe, is where all the magic happens. Oh, she's so pretty. I don't know why, I just didn't expect it to look so, um, maybe like high tech, <laughs> so digital, but it's awesome. It's like so streamlined, it's really nice. It's not as big as what I was expecting, which is awesome because I have a lot of things in the kitchen already. <laughs> and yeah, I'll start turning this on and having a look at those recipes. It's super exciting. Okay, I'm just gonna unlock this bowl. Ooh. Oh, there's more in here. <laughs> okay, so we've got a little basket. This here looks really high quality. Big, nice stainless steel bowl here. And it's got the little blade at the base as well, which will be awesome for chopping things, blending things. Nice. Oh, that is so satisfying doing that. <laughs> I think that's in. That was a good sound. That was a good click. Now I know I probably should read the manual, but apparently it's intuitive. So I am gonna test that out. And I also just spotted these little rubber things here at the base are awesome because it locks it in. And when it's doing things like chopping and blending and all those things at a really high speed, you want that security of your appliance. Cause I've had situations before where yeah, 
there's been smoothie go all up a wall. It hasn't been pretty. Let's turn it on and see what happens. Now I did spot a little on off button here on the side, so I'll just get that on. <gasps> Yay! Oh, straight into it. How good is this? This is super user friendly. Oh, touch screen. Hell yes. And I guess that's home. Ooh, nice. All right, so we've got breakfast, mains, desserts, desserts, soups, sauces and dips, drinks, side dishes, bread. Oh, I can make my own bread. Healthy, vegetarian, baking snacks and salads. Awesome. So this must be where all of the recipes are housed. Um, I'll just have a quick look in desserts, see what they've got. Yum. Appleberry custard crumble, crepes. And I haven't even used the manual for this. It's just super easy to use. I'm just scrolling through it like I would like, kind of like using my phone. Um, chocolate ice cream, frozen fruit sorbet. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Pure fruit ice cream. Yum, chocolate self-sourcing pudding. Mm -hmm. Ooh, panna cotta. I've never made a panna cotta before. Maybe this will be the reason to. Oh, oh, sick, they've got lemon meringue pie. I can't wait to make that one. Okay, cool, slightly distracted. Um, but this morning, I'm gonna make a smoothie. So let's go see what we've got here under drinks. Banana smoothie, cafe frappe, morning dew smoothie. That sounds pretty good. Just check I've got the ingredients. Oh, this is awesome. So it just tells you the recipe straight up. Um, so I need some apples, some honey or maple syrup and some frozen raspberries. Perfect, I got all that. And a touch of milk or yogurt if you want a creamier consistency. That sounds good. I think that's me. All right, I'm gonna go get this get the bits and pieces to make the smoothie and get my breakfast underway. Cue the sexy B-roll. This thing is so cool. I'm actually so much more like excited about it than what I realized. Okay, got the goods here for my morning dew smoothie. Might leave the instruction manual to the side. I'll just, I'll just use that if I need to. But I've got apples, honey, frozen berries, and yogurt, which is optional. Cool. Now it says it's got a built-in scale, so I'm gonna test that out. I'm assuming the image that looks like a scale is a scale, so let's see. Perfect, and I'll tear it to make it zero. Perfect, this is so easy. Really takes the thinking out of cooking. So if maybe you like someone that likes to be in the kitchen but doesn't have a lot of time or doesn't want to think about what to make, then this would be a great option for you. Because even though I love being in the kitchen and I am in the kitchen all the time, sometimes I just run out of ideas of what to make. Okay, this built-in scale is so good. You know you're a baker when you're like <laughs> frothing on that built-in scale. <laughs> oh, too funny. All right, so we're at 130. 305. That's good enough for me. I'm gonna tear it again because I need to add some other ingredients. 150 grams of frozen berries. So I've got some raspberries here and some blueberries. Ooh, actually is really good. I was wondering how it would go with something like honey, because sometimes scales take a while to catch up, um, but this one was all over it. And just to make it that little bit creamy, I am going to add some coconut yogurt. Yum. Ingredients are in, I'm gonna lock this on. Got it? Feels nice and safe and sturdy. Blend for approximately one minute, speed 10 until smooth. Okay, so that looks like the timer. This looks like the speed. So I'm gonna go to 10. 
That is so cool. It's like literally like a spinning wheel you just add however much time you want. I think we're gonna do it. I'm scared. I'm scared and excited. I assume we press this button. I'm not sure. Let's go. Let's try it. Oh my God, <laughs> this thing is powerful. Did you see that? Holy moly, I'm like in shock. <laughs> so cool. And as you can see, so user-friendly. I didn't even use the manual at all. All right, let's check out this breakfast smoothie. Oh, it looks so pretty. Awesome, I'm just gonna turn it off. Just. Be safety, Sally. And oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, unclip here, I think. Yep, nice. It's all so easy. Looks damn good. All right, babies, it's time for some breakfast. You ready for a smoothie? Yum, that's really good. If I keep drinking this, I'm definitely gonna get a brain freeze, <laughs> but it's too good not to. So there you go guys, my morning smoothie is sorted, my new kitchen helper is sorted, and you're gonna be starting to see me use this a whole lot more because it's absolutely awesome. If you're interested in getting one for yourself, I do have some links that I'll leave in the description box below for you. Head to Fruity, they've got a whole different, they've got a whole array pretty much of appliances you can choose from. I've just got this particular one, but they've also got blenders, um, they've got juices, they've got dehydrators. So there's all these different appliances for what you're looking for. And thank you so much to Fruity for sending me out this amazing appliance. I can't wait to use it more in the kitchen. If you do like this video, please do give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell as well because I have a new video coming out every single week. Thanks again and I'll see you again next week. Bye.